Last week we talked about the protein synthesis and we will continue to talk about protein, protein synthesis. We talked about transcription, translation and folding. After the protein chain is produced in the ribosome, it is not usable yet. It has to be modified to be uh, used in cell properly. Main part of the modification is folding that we talked about last week. The other modifications may include cleaving, attaching other biochemical functional groups like phosphate, acetate, carbohydrates and lipids. Mm -hmm. Or uh, processing like uh, changing the chemical nature of the um, uh, amino acids. Yes. For example, changing amino acid uh, arginine or amino acid, uh, sorry, into amino acid uh, citrulline. Yes. Or changing the structure, for example, uh, forming the sulfid uh, bridges and some other complex chemical modifications. Yes, uh, all of them are very complex, yes. as you say. And according to these modifications, uh, its job changes, the, pro uh, the job of the pro protein chains. After a normal translation, it may be folded and start its duty in cytoplasm. Nothing is done here, uh, just folding. Or during the translation, a special code called signal sequence may be formed as the sequence of the amino acid is produced. The information of this signal sequence, uh, sequence comes from the DNA. During the transcription process, this information in the DNA transcript to the mRNA. Mm -hmm. After that, uh, mRNA is translated to amino acids. That, uh, this is how uh, the information comes from the DNA. And here we see the signal sequence is red. This is the ticket of the protein. According to this signal, it goes to its specific destination. And proteins uh, which have this coding may, co uh, may go to nucleus, uh, mitochondria or chloroplast in uh, plants. Or sometimes, sometimes while the translation process continues, protein may be coded with another special signal sequence. When the signal sequence is produced, a special protein called signal recognition particle comes to ribosome. MashaAllah, it is very amazing that you are talking about proteins, but there are some signals that they can understand yes. from each other. How could it be possible that you give any signal and these signals have different meanings? Yes. And all the proteins around there, only mm -hmm. the ones that are related to this signal understands the meaning mm -hmm. yes. and acts according to that signal. Yes. They are not making any mistake because if they make any mistake, it means harm and it yes. means uh, destroying yes. but they're always understanding the correct meaning and acting according to that and we are talking about signal uh, it is not signal that we are talking about uh, that we think uh, actually the signal is just the sequence of the amino acids yes. the order of the amino acids this is the signal and uh, all the cell recognize this yes. all the cell of the all living beings in the world Mashallah. Yes, Mashallah. Mashallah. when this protein comes translation stops for a while then ribosome messenger RNA and the amino acid chain are taken to rough endoplasmic reticulum and from the start to here we see that all the jobs are done by the other proteins. We, uh, if one of them is missing there, uh, there will be error uh, in the protein synthesis in the modifications so that protein will not be produced and this may cause that this, very, uh, this causes very serious problems. When it reaches the rough endoplasmic reticulum, doesn't, it doesn't set us on anywhere around them. It connects to signal recognition particle receptor. And we will talk about uh, this subject uh, next week in details, inshallah. inshallah. When it settles safely, it continues its translation. After the translation has finished here, the signal, uh, signal sequence part is uh, cleaved by signal peptidase. This is also a protein. So uh, we continue to see that all the uh, steps are uh, done by the other proteins. Yes. At the end of this process, it is released inside of the endoplasmic reticulum or it stays in the membrane of the endoplasmic reticulum and it starts to work in there. Yes. And being in the membrane of the endoplasmic reticulum is a very complex process because uh, the proteins uh, put the, this uh, protein which is in production like a sewing machine and we will see this in next week also, inshallah. And after the ones which are uh, released uh, to in inside of the endoplasmic reticulum, another signal sequence is added on them and they s start their duty inside of the endoplasmic reticulum because proteins are needed there also. Or they may be carboxylated. What does it mean? A carb uh, carbohydrate group is added to protein and folded more, then sent to lysosome or cell membrane for their duty. Or the proteins which are folded inside of the endoplasmic reticulum 
may be sent to Golgi apparatus and start their duty there. Or they may be modified more in Golgi apparatus and a ticket is given to them. It, uh, this is a very special ticket. And uh, Golgi apparatus is the post office of the cell. Mm -hmm. According to their tickets, each of them have their special tickets. Uh, according to tickets, they are grouped like pass uh, passengers in an air airport that to be sent to their uh, own specific destinations. This is something very special and the structure of the gold apparatus is very special. Yes. Uh, we will uh, see that also next week, inshallah. After uh, the last process that I talked about, they may go outside of the cell uh, or to lysosome for their duties. And every step we talked about, these are very complex pro uh, processes. And all, are, all of them are done by the other proteins. And there is no mistake happens here. They are always working flawlessly. Mashallah. 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 And I want to read a verse. I seek refuge in Allah from the cursed Satan. Everyone in the heavens and earth requests his aid. Every day he is engaged in some affair. So which of your Lord's blessings do you both then deny? Surat Ar-Rahman 29 and 30. We are talking about special steps, complex special steps. All these steps are done by proteins. But as I, uh, as always I said, protein is not a living being. It is unconscious. It doesn't have soul. It, uh, it cannot think. It, has, it doesn't have that kind of memory that we think about. It doesn't have any wisdom, but uh, makes all these jobs perfectly. Mashallah. This Mashallah. is the wisdom uh, conscious of Allah. Mashallah. And Allah creates all of them one by one in every moment. Mashallah. And all the proteins that you have mentioned are already produced, get yes. through all these steps. Yes. They are already uh, passed through the ribosome and mm -hmm. then uh, through the yes. Golgi apparatus, get the ticket. If they are the hormones, they get out of the cell. If they have any business in the lysosome or mitochondria or any place of the cell, yes. they travel through that destination. And they are all other proteins that will make it together. Yes. Yes. Mashallah. It is like a... Uh, factory that is building its own machines. And this example is can be found in Mr. Adnan Oktar's book uh, about the protein, the miracle in the protein. This is very uh, wonderful book. Mashallah. 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 Mashallah.